Yo, what is up, guys? It is me, Wacky Monkey, and today I'm doing. Today I'm doing a video I've been wanting to do for a while, but I finally can do it. So let's just start from the beginning. Exactly a week ago, on Monday, I'm filming this on Monday. Exactly a week ago, I started my Vinted journey. So basically, I got the app after my brother told me he got a Brazilian Ronaldo shirt for like 20 quid and he got some Yeezys for like 80 quid I was like okay I need to start looking at this app so okay so I got the app straight away guys I spent 14 pounds I was just looking for football jerseys because I just I want to get my collection up and I want names on the back of my tops because I don't really have any names on the back of my tops so I was just looking through and I saw a random thing ever. I saw this Aubameyang I think it's Olympicas or Marseille or I think it's Olympicas Marseille um kit and i was like wait a minute it actually looks kind of cool on it and it's it's got the name on the back it looks real like that's one of the first things i thought about vintage i was like how do i know if it's real or not i compared it online it looks legit guys it looks legit plus the guy was putting it up for about 20 quid i was like this is a steal this is actually a steal and i'm i bargained with him got it for 14 pounds guys the t-shirt and the shorts i was like this is this is unreal this is, I've just had vintage for like 20 minutes and I've already found this and then um, the delivery for my first one was free as well so I was like yes straight W's and then it came literally like I think it was five days later it came on and came on the Saturday and I was I opened it and it didn't even smell bad it was actually good guys and here it is obviously Obviously, I don't want to be a full kit person all the time, but in this Bamiyan kit, guys, I might have to. Look, look, look at that. That, that can't be fake, right? That can't be fake. I'm I'm 90% sure about all these, that these are real. Also, this, I'm wearing this because I was wearing it today, but yeah, this is also what I brought, but I'll talk about that later. Look at this. Obama who? Obama what? through the apps and all that and it is literally literally real also look at that authentic license football i'm pretty sure that means it's real guys but yeah love this top worn it once because obviously i've only had it for a week i've already spent 80 quid guys in this week of having been it it's actually changed my life i'm probably never gonna buy clothes anywhere else apart from like that's a lie i will but Football and NBA jerseys, I'm definitely going to stick to Vinted. That's the first day of Vinted. And that same day, I put a bid in for a Michael Jordan jersey because I've always wanted one, a red one, because red's my favourite colour. I've always wanted one. And I found one for, f I think it was 20 quid as well. I think it was somewhat, something like, I'll put it on the screen. It was something like that. Um, I put in a bid and the person, we, we, we negotiated for a bit. And I was asking, like, is it real? Is it men's large? Is it all that stuff? And they were like, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, with these stuff, I make sure I look at the person's reviews. I make sure they at least have about five five gold stars. And literally, they just have... The minimum person I'll deal with is a four and a half star person. I'm not going below that because you just can't trust them. You can't you can't trust... Well, that's my personal experience because obviously I don't want to get scammed. Especially, you can't trust these people, man. But yeah, I bidded for this. I was looking on as soon as I saw it I looked online and um the first one I saw that was exactly the same because obviously there's a lot of Michael Jordan jerseys the first one I saw was actually 150 quid but I've not managed to find that and since but I have found one <laughs> that was like 25 quid but still I don't I, you know I think that could have been a fake I don't know it's not fully like new like it's got some markings in that but it's like I don't care I don't, I, I don't bother like those markings would happen even if I had the shirt the jersey you know what I mean um I'm very happy with it. It's probably my favourite buy out of all of them. What's funny was the person that I got it off also put up some LeBron Lakers ones for like 20, 40 quid, I think, because she put up two and home and away. But they were XL, so I didn't get them. And then in the morning I woke up and they they changed the price to like 180. Cause and they were like, Oh, I've just realized the um they're more expensive than I thought. So I don't know if I've scammed them. It wasn't intentional at all, but definitely a W in my books. This one 
was a less intentional one. I was just scrolling through and I saw a Kyrie Irving Brooklyn Nets jersey. I was like, this guy, he's not a GOAT, but he's, he's, he's one of my favorite players of all time. Him and Kevin Durant. Not as specifically when they're at Brooklyn Nets, but it was it was like 18 quid or something. I narrowed it down. I think, I don't know exactly the price, but it was somewhere below 15, I think. And, they, and because summer's coming up, guys, I want to get my jerseys on fleet, you know? I want to get the best, like... I'll just be wearing t-shirts and that all the time in the next month for the next few months so I thought why not why not splash the cash I spent 80 quid this week guys or last week depending on what time this video comes out the guy was super nice gave it straight away this guy had bought it off the Nike website and then he said it was too small for him so I'm guessing he's quite large or whatever but um yeah this is this is this one I can guarantee is legit I can guarantee this one's legit because it literally is fresh off the website. It's got all the tags. Like so far, all these things have the exact tags that they do. There's, there's literally even if they, if they are fake, it's like you would not be able to tell at all. I'm just gonna take this Michael Jordan one, guys. Drop in the comments if you can tell if any of them's fake or if, if there's something I can look for to see, identify if it's fake or not. Um, either way, I'll be wearing them, but obviously I don't want to get a fake, but I did ask about that because I thought that was like, I was like, yeah, is that fake? And they were like, no, that's just how it's done and it actually is because I compared it. So, yeah. And then finally, guys, finally, it's the shirt I'm wearing. Juventus 2018-19 Ronaldo jersey. So this one, I was just scrolling through again. And I saw it for like eighteen pounds. I put it, I put in bids for everything, man. The lowest, like lowest bids, because I just people are just desperate to sell, aren't they? And this one, this, I got it down to fourteen pounds, I think. And I was like, dang, is it real though? Because obviously it's got that thing there. I'm like, that looks a bit fake to me. But I compared it online. Apart from that, everything's legit. Like if it, if it is fake, it is identical. Apart from these bits, I don't know if that's just my shoulders though. These bits are meant to go there. Oh, it does go there. It's not fake. I'm joking. I don't know if it's fake. But yeah, I went to outside today with it on. My friend said he thought it could be fake because of that bit. That is throwing it off. And it's not exactly in the middle as well. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I compared it online and it seems li literally legit. And all the tags and that are legit as well. But. Out of all the ones that could be fake, it's this one. But this is definitely my second favorite as well. The Chicago Bulls one's my favorite, and this is my second favorite. So, so far, this is all I've spent on Vinted. It's only been a week. I'm definitely going to spend more, but I need to. I'm now waiting for ones I really like. Like these ones, I really like, especially the Chicago Bulls and this one, I really like. But the Irving one and the Marseille one was just because it was cheap. So the more ones I see that were cheap and good, I'll get. But I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope you guys have taken away something from this. Also, guys, you make friends on the way. Look at these reviews I got. It's actually it's actually so nice that people actually care to put a review because I reviewed on every single person, apart from this one, because this can this kind of kind of came late because the person was having family issues or something. I don't really know, but yeah. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, comment. If you want more vids like this, this is a rare vid from me, but just because. I just spent a week on vintage, so that's watching. Subscribe, like, comment. Goodbye.